Hey everybody, welcome, welcome back to, to the Basic, Basic Baka Club. Club. Uh, just a minute ago, you were saying that. Uh, That's because. You uh, good to. Uh, Baka. Never mind, okay? Baka. Well, anyways, you'll be fine by yourself, right, Yuri? No. Sure. I'm used to it after all. Oh, Yuri, I love Aww. you. Oh, Yuri. <sighs> um. That's good. Ouch. Even though Yuri is so melodramatic, it's a little hard not oh, to feel bad. I'm so low. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't worry, honey. It builds character. <laughs> that's everything, right? Anything else we need to talk about? Nah, I think that's it. Are you guys excited? No. Yes. Yeah. You guys better wear rubber. <laughs> Everything except the performance is gonna be awesome. I don't think that really counts. What about you, Baka? Me? Uh, I guess you could say I'm interested in how singing how it'll turn out. It's good enough for me. <laughs> what about you, Yuri? Oh fuck you, Monica. I mean, Yuri. She's still sulking. You're the worst. <laughs> good. You better watch your back. Good. Let the hate flow through <laughs> you. Flow through you. Consume you. Consume you. <laughs> <sighs> Natsuki starts pouting too. Why is Natsuki pouting? Pouting is contagious, okay? <laughs> it's not. I mean, it's not that big of a deal or anything. I always gravitate towards Monica's boob. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> They're just, just right. Yeah. It might not be just that. Hmm? I think that Yuri might just be feeling a little underappreciated in general. Why don't you all just meet up and have a party? Yeah. Like, like have but there's a- no ovens in school. Well, like, meet up at somebody's house and, like... Yeah. yeah like, it'll all be fun, you know? Fun. Having to come up with something for her to do and then nobody offering her to help? Wow, we are all assholes. That doesn't mean that I'm an asshole. It means that you're an asshole, Baka. Natsuki glasses back and forth between everyone and worried expression. Look. Natsuki goes over and puts a hand on Yuri's shoulders. Yuri, you really are the most talented one here. And you're going to help make uh, the event extra more fun and welcoming. I mean, the cupcakes will probably help a lot too. But you're going to make the atmosphere special. That'll be really important for the way that people want to feel during the performance. So, you need to stop being dumb and give yourself a little bit more credit. Baka. Natsuki releases her hand and turns around her face the other direction. Uh, it didn't really mean that, did you? Um, not really. Oh, wow. Yikes. Okay, claws out. Ow. <laughs> Yuri isn't the only one surprised. Monica and I are also taken back by Natsuki's words. <laughs> Jeez! Okay, frenemies. Natsuki, of all people, to be saying such encouraging things, I begin to understand. Natsuki was trying to sound like Sayori. Aww. Aww. <laughs> Even if it didn't work out perfectly, I can tell that she tried to say something Sayori would say at a time like this. Because Sayori is always hoping uh, everyone smile and feel good about themselves. I really love Sayori! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry for being dumb. That's right. You should. <laughs> I'm going to do my best. That's right. That's all we ask. All of us are going to make it a really great event. Yeah. Nobody loves me. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> yeah. I hope to see everyone do their best. But with that, there's nothing more today, so I guess it's time for us to head out. Okay, but I'm going to stay here a bit longer. I barely got to do any reading today, so. Fair enough. There's nothing wrong with that. Everyone packs up their things. I start to follow Monica and Yuri out the door, but as they chat between each other. Um, where are you going? Eh? We still need to figure out our plans for this weekend. <sighs> <laughs> we literally would have gotten home and realized you wouldn't- you didn't have any way of contacting me. Oh, but yeah, I guess that's true. I have no idea how that slipped my mind. Jeez, good thing I stopped you. I'm giving you my number, okay? You better not make it weird or anything. I'm gonna make it weird. <laughs> but why would I do that? <laughs> Natsuki gives me her number. Okay. I'm coming over on Sunday. Wait, why is she coming over to my house if she gave me her number? Wait. 
You're coming to my house? Well, yeah. What's wrong with that? I mean, I just figured since I'm the one helping, I would go to your house. Yeah, right? Like, I would have a guy come over to my house? I mean, that's true. My dad would kill me. Really? I can't uh, kind of strict if you ask me. Yeah, how do you think I feel? I can't do anything since my dad's home. Anyway, I just need to complain for a sec. We have each other's numbers now. That's all I need from you. I guess I'll text you when I'm coming over. All right, fine by me. How do you know where I live? <laughs> yeah. I'm only gonna show you how I, why I love baking so much. Oh. I'm gonna show you. Oh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> so you'd better look forward to it. Mm. <laughs> oh. Didn't you say you were gonna give me the dirty work? <laughs> yeah, oh. yeah. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> Well, I was just saying that it's not like I could act like in front of everyone that I was looking forward to this. Wait, really? Well, kind of. Just because I've never got to bake with anyone else before. Oh. And that's all. So, all right, I get it. Sorry for overreacting. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'll be heading out now. See you on Sunday. Uh, uh, but never mind. I can't believe this! Natsuki's gonna come over to my house on Sunday? Even though I'd have preferred to do this with Sayori, my anxiety shoots through the roof. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I guess I've gotten pretty used to handling her at this point. But who knows what might end up happening once we're outside of school. <laughs> <laughs> mm. uh, she even told me she was looking forward to it. That's cute. I shake my head. <laughs> Why would I feel nervous that Sayori's finding out about this? Uh, it's not like I feel that way for each other. Besides, Monica said this is about the club. I have nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. If I just go with it, I'll have a good time. Mm -hmm. Nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> it's already Sunday. Yay! I've been getting increasingly anxious about Natsuki's upcoming visit. Yay! I keep telling myself there's no reason to be nervous, but I mean, I guess I don't have parents or I live by myself, something like that. But it doesn't matter much. I wonder if she'll, she'll act any different when it's just two of us. Yeah, she will. Meanwhile, she's been texting me a lot. We sent each other one after another, exchanging numbers to double check, but as it turns into a conversation. She's almost a different person on the phone. She uses tons of emojis and cute language. That's cute. She also really likes complaining about things, but I saw, kinda saw that one coming. Putting Natsuki aside. I haven't heard a single thing from Sayori since she left the club early the other day. It's not like we text each other all the time or anything. You should, but mm. I've been worried about her in the back of my mind. Then... Ask her if she's okay between Sayori, what Sayori said and Monica said. Uh, is it really okay for me to put Sarah's feelings aside when she might need me? Yeah. Hi. I decided to visit Sarah before Natsuki comes house. over. Yeah, it is. Goals. Rather than asking, I simply tell her I'm coming over, much like we've done in the past. Once I reach Sarah's house, I knock on the door and enter myself. Again, we used to play so often, we made it a habit of simply entering each other's houses when, like, we're a family. It's kind of weird, The house though. is quiet. Yeah. Sarah isn't anywhere on the first floor, so I assume she's up in her room. It's already strange of her not to run down and greet me. I head up to her bedroom where I finally find her. Oh, mm. Sayori. This brings back memory. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Hi Baka. Baka. I sit down. Wait, what's that on her, on her chair? It's like leggings. I sit down on the patched up. Oh, I sit down in her chair, in her room. Sorry forces a smile, but it's easy to tell that she's different. There's a I'm minute different. of silence between us. I'm different. You haven't come over like this in a long time. Your plants you know? are dying. I guess you're right. It has been a long time. How much has really changed, has it? Sari's room is as messy as it always been. Call this messy? I mean, yeah, there's some <laughs> papers on the ground, but I mean... That's about it. I also recognize the same stuff animals and wall decorations she's had for years now. <laughs> If you come over more, more often, it wouldn't be such a mess. That's because I end up cleaning it for you. How come you wanted to come over today? Aren't you supposed to see Natsuki today? Yeah, but... Wait, how Wait. did you know that? Oh, Sayori already oh, left by the time we decided that last meeting. Monica told me. It's only natural for her to keep me informed about the festival preparations, right? Mm, that's true. But what about you? Aren't you going to be helping Monica today? 
of course. But I'm helping her online. We didn't plan to meet up or anything. Ah, so it's just me and Natsuki then. Yep. There's more silence between us. Sari stares at in a random direction. I'm staring at a random direction. <laughs> Everything about her behavior is really uncharacteristic. Maybe it's because, you know, we're both adults of opposite... Well, um, you know, we're both attracted to each other. And, mm. and it's just like, you know, you're not doing anything. So I'm not doing anything. I'm not doing anything. <laughs> I finally get to the point. I just wanted to see how you were doing. Oh, right, right. After seeing you how left I was on doing. Friday. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> seeing how I'm doing. When something's wrong, you can't hide it from me. Mm -hmm. I know you too well. So, Sari smiles, shaking her head. That's. That's. It's not, it's not good, Baka. Eh? Why can't it just be like it's always been? It's all my fault. Even um, if I didn't get so weak and accidentally express my feelings, if I didn't have. If I didn't make that stupid mistake, then you wouldn't have. We wouldn't have been worried about me at all. Mm. You wouldn't have come here. You wouldn't have been thinking about me right now. But this is oh. just my punishment, isn't it? Getting punished for being so selfish. That's why you've decided to come over today, right? Mm. It was just to torture me. No. <laughs> sorry. I grabbed sorry by the shoulders. Ow. What on earth are you saying? Let go. <laughs> are you listening to yourself right now? Let go. <laughs> I know something happened to you. Let go. There's no other explanation for you to be doing something like this. Let go. So tell me already. Until I know, I won't be able to stop thinking about it. Ah. <laughs> Start shaking her. Let go. Sayori gives me an empty smile. You really put me in a trap, Baka. But... You're wrong. Nothing happened to me. I've always been like this. You're just seeing it for the first time. Seeing what? What are you talking about, Sari? <laughs> You're really just gonna make me come out and say it, aren't you? Yeah. Guess I have no choice this time. I the can't see is, anything. I've had really bad depression my whole life. No. Did you know that? No. Why you don't you have depression. Why do you think I'm late to school every day? Because you're lazy. Because most days I can't even find a reason to get out of bed. No. What reason is there to do anything when, when I know how fully worthless I am? No. Why go to school? No. Why eat? Why make friends? Why make people put their energy and caring, uh, and caring to waste by having them spend it on me? It's what it feels like. Oh. And that's why I just want to make everyone happy. Without anyone worrying about me. No! I'm in shock. Can't even figure out how to respond. Don't. <laughs> how is it possible like Sari has kept this from me her entire the entire time I've known her? Did she really want so badly for me to, to not think about her? Why, Sayori? Huh? Why is it that you never told me about this? It's almost like I've been betrayed as your closest friend. It's none of your business. <laughs> Because if I knew, I would have done everything I could to support you, even if there's only so much that I can do. I would have tried a little bit harder to make every day a little better for you. That's why I'm your friend. That's not your responsibility. Uh, all you had to do was tell me. It's not your responsibility. You don't understand it all, Baka. Why do you think I didn't tell you? Because if I told you, then you would you would have to waste your time and effort caring about me instead of doing important things. Like caring about your friends? I don't want to be cared about. Yeah. It's bittersweet when people try to care about me. It feels nice sometimes, but it also feels like, like a bat being swung against my head. Oh. <laughs> That's why I wanted so badly for you to make friends with everyone else. Oh. Helping everyone be happy together is the best thing for me. But then I discovered something else, too. Seeing you make friends and get closer with everyone at the club, it feels like a spear going through my heart. So that's why that's why I decided the world just wants to torture me. Mm. Every path leads to nothing but hurt. <laughs> You're right. I don't understand. Get help. But get help. I don't <laughs> understand your feelings at all, Sayori. No, no, no one does. But I don't need to understand. All you need is me. Whatever it takes for you to stop hurting. My dick. That's what I'll do. My dick. 
No, Baka. There's nothing. Except my dick. It's small. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nothing at all. Okay, okay. Maybe I took it a little bit too far. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Your dick is fine. <laughs> um, the only thing that could have helped is if everyone, everything could be the way it was. But I was selfish. I finally showed you what a horrible person I am. Tears streak down from Sayori's face. No. Wow. Made you join the literature club because I was selfish. And I was punished by my heart hurting in a way that I couldn't understand. And now you came here and I made you hurt too. No. I'm just weak and selfish. That's all I am. And that's why I'm going to accept these punishments. By my dick. Because I deserve every last one. My dick punishes. Without thinking, I grab Sayori's shoulders. This time I pull her into a tight embrace. She can feel my dick. Ah, your penis. Sayori, I don't care if you feel selfish. I'm really happy that you convinced me to join the club. Seeing you every day makes it worthwhile enough. If I make friends with everyone else, that's just a bonus. Please never underestimate how much I care about you. I wouldn't have it any other way. Your penis is poking me. It's making you feel better? No, it, it, it's a little uncomfortable. <laughs> Sayori isn't hugging me back. Despite my arms being wrapped around her, Sayori's arms remain at her sides. She starts sobbing into my ear. Oh. No. Don't do this to me. Please don't do this. No. Baka. I... Sayori ban- ma- barely manages to speak between her sobs. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing. You're not. <laughs> oh, but I was. All I want is for her to know that I care. If you have to call yourself selfish, then you have to let me be selfish too. No matter what it takes, I'll figure out what it needs to change. I'll make these feelings go away. And if there's anything you need me to do, then you better tell me. I'll get mad if you don't. I need $40,000. Uh, accept that. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Gently, Sayori finally puts her arms in return around me. I don't know anything. It's all really scary. I don't understand any of my feelings, Baka. Uh, The only time I'm not feeling nothing is when I'm feeling pain. Mm. But your hugs are so warm. That's really scary, too. Mm. Sayori lets me go. And as she does, I let her go as well. The festival's tomorrow. Yeah. It's gonna be fun, right? Yeah. How would you like for me to spend it all with you? Um, uh... It's what I want. I promise. I... I think that would be nice, then. Yeah! Sorry, wipes her eyes. (laughs) If I could spend the whole day with here, I would. Oh, of all days, this has to be the one where I have other plans. Maybe I should cancel. No, don't. Please don't. If you do that, then I really wouldn't forgive you. But it's almost time for Natsuki to meet me at my house. At the very least, you can come along and help us out. It'll be fun. To my surprise, Sayori shakes her head. I'm sorry. I don't know if that would be a, a very good for me today. You understand, right? Uh, it's kind of hard for me to fully understand. But I'm trying my hardest. It's okay. Don't worry too much about it. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? All right. I look forward to it. And we look forward to the next episode. episode. Remember, kids, kids, you guys will do that we No! Oh, I hate this. I hate it. Oh. Game sucks.